Hi, my name is Dr. Laura Jana. I'm a pediatrician and author and the mother of three kids, and I'm very happy to join Doral Juvenile Group and the Safety First brand in sharing today with you some tips on taking care of children's teeth. Now, I like to start out the conversation by making the point that good oral care actually starts from birth, which catches a lot of parents by surprise, seeing as how most babies aren't born with teeth. But we do know that even taking good care of your baby's gums, which can mean just simply wiping them off with either a piece of gauze or a wet washcloth after each feeding, sets your child up for really good oral hygiene habits moving forward. As soon as the first teeth start popping in, sometime in the first four to six months or so, um, you're going to want to pay close attention from then on out to taking good care of those teeth. In part, that means avoiding cavities. And really when we're talking about babies, the biggest risk comes from letting liquids, whether that's anything besides water, anything that's got sugar, so juice or milk or formula, anything pooling around your baby's teeth can lead to cavities. Find things that have well-designed, easy-to-use handles, making it easier for you to get to the teeth, and things designed specifically to clean baby's teeth. Um, you also may find that as those teeth come in, you're faced with an irritable child. Now, it has been my experience that not as many babies are fussy when they're teething as parents worry about, but if you find that your child is uncomfortable, feel free to let them chew on a teething ring or even gum on something that is designed and is safe to be in your baby's mouth. Oftentimes, simply doing that can make them feel much better. The other thing about baby teeth is that you're going to want to make sure your child gets in for their first dental visit early on. And by early, the recommendation actually is within six months of that first tooth showing up. So if your baby gets a tooth at four months, you should be heading in even before your child turns a year. For anyone whose children don't have teeth at a year, which does happen, the recommendation still is to go in and get that first checkup done and then set up for every six month dental checkups after that to ensure that your child really gets on a track for good oral health. By the age of three, most kids get all their primary teeth, so 20 baby teeth in place. And I will emphasize that baby teeth are far more important than a lot of people give them credit for. What you and your child do now to take care of them will really set up for a lifetime of good habits. It's been great sharing these tips with you, and I look forward to sharing more in partnership with Doral Juvenile Group and the Safety First brand. For more tips, be sure to sign up for the Safety First e-newsletter. You can go to safetyfirst.com and also be sure to check out more advice on their Facebook page.